Let's have a look at one of my favorite features in Affinity Publisher on the iPad. I've made some master pages here and have a look at them. So this is my first master page. We'll just show it. Over there we've got some pictures on the left hand side and there's a text box on the right and a picture above it. The second one very similar with a text box and some picture frames and the third one once again some picture frames there but the text box is now on the left hand side. And I want to try out these master pages on my document. So I'm going to go back to my pages and I'm going to click on this page over here. Now you can see on this page I've already used one of those master pages. And if we have a look at the master pages you can see the one the master B at the top has been applied to this page here. So I've got some pictures down the left, picture at the top and some text. But I want to see what it'll look like with Master C on it. And this is really good because all I do is I just drag that master over the page. Look at that. As I drag it over the page, it just moves those pictures into the new master setup. Let's have a look at Master D. I'll move it across. So all you do is you just drag it over to have a look at what it looks like. Look at that. Even my text is moving from one side to the other. Now you can actually do that in preview mode as well. It looks much better that way so you just drag it over, see what it looks like, drag it over once again, see what it looks like and if you really like it just release and it will update on that particular master or with that particular master page. Anyway when you get your copy of Publisher have a go with that. It is such a fun thing to do and incredibly useful. If you'd like to learn more about Affinity or Adobe, have a look at the links below. We've got some really good training programs on Udemy and Skillshare and there's some really good deals down there.